If you represent yourself in court, you must follow the same rules that the lawyers have to follow. That means that you will have to meet deadlines, like filing papers with the court on time. If you do something wrong, there may be serious consequences, maybe even as serious as losing your case. Most courts function during the business day, so you will need to make arrangements to get off work or find child care so that you can be in court during that time. You will need to file papers in the clerk's office and go to hearings before the judge. Being organized is important. You will need to keep track of the things that you have to do in the case, the court's deadlines, and all of the papers that you and the other side give to the court. You will have to pay attention to details. There will likely be a lot of paperwork, and you will have to prove your case with evidence, such as testimony from witnesses, or documents like pay stubs, receipts, and income tax returns. You will need to plan every detail of presenting your case to the judge, and then do it in a way that's effective and precise. If your case is a divorce case, ask yourself these next questions as well. Are you looking to get even? Do you have valuable property such as a house, a pension, or a retirement account? Was there physical or emotional abuse in your marriage? Or do you find yourself yelling at your spouse whenever you're trying to make decisions together about your kids or your money? If you answered yes to any of these questions, think seriously about getting a lawyer. A lawyer will not be as emotionally involved, so the lawyer can help you make good legal decisions. If your case involves domestic violence, please watch the video titled Get a Protective Order. It explains how to get a protective order in Texas. The next part of this video will give a short explanation about mediation, which is a way to work out your problem without going to court. If you want more information about mediation, look for the video titled Learn About Mediation right on this website.